The year 2014 radically changed Ukraine. Military operations in the east of the country have shown the incredible courage of the Ukrainian people. Every day, the modern history of Ukraine remembers the names of heroes who stand guard over peace and sovereignty of their country. The history of revival, formation and achievements of the armed forces of Ukraine and Ukrainian law enforcement agencies in the special project Ukraine in Uniform. They were selected according to the highest requirements. Tall, strong, endurant, without a single flaw on their faces. They are those who wear graceful and symmetrical uniforms, who have the honor to meet foreign rulers and official delegations on Ukrainian land. So who are these military servicemen of the presidential regiment and how can one get to serve in the ceremonial guard? Watch further in our program. Meter after meter, the servicemen of the ceremonial guard, which is part of the presidential regiment, are marching in tune with a drumbeat. The name of the military unit speaks for itself. It is the regiment of the head of state. It means it is special, it is elite. Watching these men in their graceful uniforms in parades and at various official events may think that their service is easy and prestigious. Of course, we will not argue about the prestigious, but the fact that the service is easy is quite debatable. Exhausting work and constant training is what makes their steps graceful and each and one of their movements sharp. The service is very prestigious. Soldiers of the ceremonial guard are in line of sight of everyone. But serving in it is somewhat difficult psychologically, and the whole service period is extremely monotonous. There are constant drills and physical training, and it just so happens that it can be very difficult morally. But experience shows that almost all servicemen adapt. It takes at least six months for a serviceman to become operational in the prestigious ranks of the ceremonial guard. There are special selection criteria for those wishing to serve in the ceremonial guard battalion. They must be at least 182 centimeters tall. They must have had no injuries, especially to their legs. They must have no convictions and be mentally well developed with a high level of intellect. They must have no scars, especially on their faces, as they are the face of the nation. The men must be handsome. They are the first faces that foreign delegations, presidents and defense ministers of foreign states see. If the best men of all the regions of Ukraine get into the presidential regiment, then the best of the best get into the ceremonial guard. Who are they, those lucky ones who are selected to serve in the ceremonial guard? And why only the most capable servicemen can take part in all official governmental events? The representatives of the elite unit will tell us themselves in their own words. Everyone knows that the ceremonial guard battalion is a disciplinary structure. I knew where I was going to serve. We have eight hours of drills per day, physical training. Our parents understand that it's hard for us, so they support us. That makes our service easier. The preparation for the parade is the most difficult and responsible task we must overcome. We show who we really are. We show that we are the ceremonial guard battalion. We must show ourselves 100%. Of course, it is very difficult for beginners, but they are treated in a special way here. All the commanders have served in the regiment for many years, and they always find an approach to every new recruit. 
The Ceremonial Guard Battalion is one big family where everyone supports each other, shares their experience and performs their assigned functions. Our battalion of the Ceremonial Guard of the separate regiment of the President of Ukraine performs many ceremonial tasks. Namely, it welcomes state officials of the highest level and representatives of other countries, raises the flag of the country of visiting officials, participates in parades, performs the ritual of laying wreaths at monuments and graves of soldiers and the leadership of Ukraine. All the activities the battalion performs are very important. Since we represent the armed forces of Ukraine, we must be an example of the performance of drill techniques and service duty as a whole. For the second consecutive year, the recruits of the Presidential Regiment have been taking the oath before the President of Ukraine in the Museum of World War II. The solemn event is broadcast live and is watched not only by the relatives of the recruits, but also by millions of people throughout the country and around the world. This is a special event for the servicemen of our regiment. The oath of allegiance to the homeland itself is for life, and here it is also received by the president of Ukraine. It is exciting and honorable. Почесна варта, оркестр почесної варти до проведення заходів готові. Вітаю! Ой! Вважай здоров'я! Такі заняття проводяться щодня згідно розкладу занять. Such training is held on a daily basis in accordance with the schedule of classes of the battalion. We have just been practicing the ritual of a foreign state president meeting the president of Ukraine. It was a ceremonial guard drill for which the best servicemen that are capable of fulfilling their tasks at the highest level are selected. Knowing the anthem of Ukraine by heart is included as one of the requirements of the selection process to the ceremonial guard. Performing the anthem is mandatory for all servicemen, so everyone marching knows the anthem by heart and sings it from their heart. Certainly, just performing the national anthem is not enough to get into the ceremonial guard. All elements of the official protocol must also be performed impeccably. Servicemen take part in various events with delegations from foreign states through the Cabinet of Ministers, the Ministry of Defence and of course meet and see off foreign delegations. The personnel capable of performing certain tasks are constantly performing those tasks, while the rest of the personnel who have not yet reached that level continue to train and improve their skills. Defile is one of the show elements, the purpose of which is to capture the interest of the audience. We show the best of what we have. Our defile consists of three parts. We start with the military march, which I called, part of my immodesty, the march of the ceremonial guard. Then we have the score part, accompanied by more contemporary music. And we finish with the Ukrainian part as the grand finale of our show.
The selection in the regimental orchestra requires special musical education. Instead of irreproachable appearance, one has to go through auditions and show their professional skills. Our team is very powerful and we are highly capable of carrying out the tasks that we are assigned. The main functions of the orchestra are performing at appointments, namely government events, with the participation of the President of Ukraine, the Speaker of the Vohovna Rada and the Prime Minister, as well as meetings of foreign delegations and the like, and of course enhancing the image and the prestige of the armed forces of Ukraine. Military operations in the east of the country have made their adjustments in the training of servicemen of the separate presidential regiment. Many soldiers of the regiment have been through the hell of the war in the Donbass. They say that the combat experience helps in service and in training recruits. Since May 2014, Dmitro Velikovinenko has been protecting the Ukrainian border. Now he is a platoon commander of the ceremonial guard. The experience gained in the ATO is unchanged in my life. I have acquired new principles, different ideals and different requirements to myself. Today I have my own personnel. I know everything inside out. And I know what words to choose to cheer the guys up, how to set the right mood and how to correct them. Their motivation is strong as they are the face of the armed forces of Ukraine. I believe that serving in the ceremonial guard company is a very responsible, honorable and worthy job. This is a pride for my parents, for my friends and for my family who see me serving during such very important official state events. I also take pride in myself being in such a service. I am very proud to serve in the regiment of the ceremonial guard battalion. For me, serving in the President's regiment is not just service. Here I realize myself as a man, as a defender and as a father. I know that today the Presidential Regiment is a reputable name, and not just a name of a military unit, but the elite of the armed forces. It is a very important status and we must accept it and take pride in it with dignity. Such a military unit is the only one in the armed forces of Ukraine. I direct all my efforts in the service to keep the separate Kiev regiment of the President of Ukraine to be the best unit, being in an elite unit of the army. I am proud to serve in the position of commander of the separate regiment of the President of Ukraine. Я горжусь тим, що я проходжу службу на цій посаді командира окремого полку президента України. The heroes of today's program protect the state of Ukraine, its sovereignty and territorial integrity. The Ukrainian army is doing everything so that civilians do not have to take up weapons to protect the country. In closing, we wish you peaceful skies and see you in the next program.